Hi, I'm Mary with Lightpost Publishing, and I am so excited. Thomas Kincaid has just finished another work of art, and it's called The Forest Chapel, and I think you'll be as moved by it as I was when I first saw it. Now, in 1998, Thomas Kincaid took the tradition of his chapel paintings and created a whole new era when he introduced the now famous series Chapels of Nature. The first painting in this series was the Mountain Chapel, and well, it was regarded by many experts as one of Tom's most definitive artistic statements because, well, it embraced many aspects of his work. Now, his newest painting, The Forest Chapel, is the long-awaited second piece in the Chapels of Nature series, and here it is. The chapel's on a quiet wooded setting, perhaps along the outer edge of a lake, and in the distance, you can see the morning mist rising from this hidden lake in the back. You see climbing roses along the front of the chapel building. And of course, there are azaleas and rhododendrons, wild foxgloves, all lining the forest floor, among many other flowers. The trees suggest that perhaps cool mornings of autumn are on their way. And then details like decorative plums make it a very colorful forest. When I started the painting, I remember uh, the composition originally showed a uh, little footbridge. In fact, in the pencil sketch, you can see a little bridge going across the stream in front of the church. And as I worked on the painting, I, I began to think, you know, a bridge is a wonderful little architectural touch, but I want to keep people over on the side of the church. I want the feeling that there's a world beyond the church. And as you look behind the church there, you see a, almost a sense of a little lake and a pathway that goes into the distance. Uh, there's something wonderful in my mind about um, how this building, being a white clabbered type structure, blends with the landscape. It almost is like the New England scenes that you see of little village nestled in the woods. Uh, they seem to blend in so beautifully, and that's the feel I really wanted to get. I've painted many chapels, but I don't think I've ever painted the effect of stained glass before, or if I have, uh, it's rare. And I really enjoyed the sense of light within the church. You can almost sense the uh, people within the uh, little chapel, uh, perhaps gathering to worship. The Forest Chapel as a painting embodies so many different aspects that have really made Thomas Kincaid's artwork a link to the great masters of the past. Thomas Kincaid's paintings are truly worlds in and of themselves. He speaks passionately in a language that's a language unto itself, the language of landscape. But in fact, his paintings are more than just pictorial recreations. He is truly in the tradition of sublime landscape painters of the past who thought of landscape as a language unto itself. In the Forest Chapel, we see the hallmark use of light, for which Thomas Kincaid has become so famous, but we also see more than that. There's a subtle sense in which the painting embodies a message of hope, a fleeting glimpse that all is well with the world. An artist doesn't create a painting. It paints itself. There is something about the connection between an artist and his canvas that is beyond the description of we might call it a skill or a, uh, you know, a technique. Well, to me, it's far beyond technique. That'd be like telling me that you can teach a pastor how to give a sermon. Well, you might be able to teach him how to organize his thoughts, but when the sermon comes alive on its own, uh, that's when you know it's, it's a work that is truly inspired. The Forest Chapel as a second piece in a series will be very sought after, especially considering the extreme popularity of the Mountain Chapel. The textural effects within the painting and the brushwork will be beautifully captured by the color separation and also the digital mastering process that we at Lightpost Publishing call luminous lithography. Now, this special technique enables us to capture not just the colors of the painting, but the texture and the awesome sense of light as well. The Forest Chapel will be available in three sizes in canvas lithograph, 16 by 20, 20 by 24, and 24 by 30. And the first phase of the paper lithograph issue will be 20 by 24. For more information, talk to your art consultant.